Today is Wednesday, May 23, 2018. This two year, seven month old hamster had a lump on the lower belly. And uh, you can see here, there, show, show, 90 degrees. And it was operated how many days ago? 2015. About 15 days ago, as you can see, there's a subcutaneous fat lump and uh, it could be an abscess as well. So the differential diagnosis is lump or abscess. So as you can see, I've done a case study on this and uh, you just read the text. The dwarf text. hamster mm. is two years old and seven months. Mm. Old, very old, but has good appetite and passes larger than normal fecal balance. Mm. It is worth paying for surgery. The owner decided to take the anesthetic. Okay, so now we, we do the we see the post op. Then the next 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 uh, image will show. So under isoprene gas anesthesia, uh, can you read read the wording the text? Dwarf hamster, female, two years two years seven month old. Lady owner worried about anesthetic death mm. as this hamster is very old. The vet has to be very careful with isofluorine gas mm. anesthesia uh, as so he went under within a few seconds. Mm, yeah, it's very uh, old so it doesn't need long to, to anesthetize him so don't wait until he's uh, fully anesthetized because he'll be dead by then. Okay, now he's back, okay, he's back here now. We put the hamster, uh, we weigh the hamster first. Last time was 43 grams, then now 15 days later Let's see, how many grams? 40. 40, yeah. So he wasn't really putting on weight, no. Wait, let me sh show show the, the eye first. Then. Where's the pimple? Now, just leave it steady, uh, this steady. Now, we notice that there's a pimple. It's called the subconjunctival abscess uh, on the left eye. So he's been scratching his eye, and then there's a hair loss. Is there a hair loss around the periphery of the eyelids. Huh? Now this this uh, pin abscess is uh, quite big. It's about uh, how many millimeter? Three? About three millimeter in in the diameter. Okay so they look like the other eye. I, I point it, okay point it uh, that there is the abscess. It's called a subcontinent level abscess. It's quite common in hamsters. Some dirt has gone into the the eyelid, under the eyelid. Uh. Okay, see the other eye? Now we check both eyes. Now you just have a quick, uh, let me just zoom on. Uh, there isn't any, uh, there isn't any abscess. Now this hamster has cataract. I don't know whether it's obvious or not. Just open up a bit, you can see. Uh. Yeah, my, uh, open like that. Uh. You see, it's all white, cataract. Uh. It's two years, seven months old. Okay, now we're going to anesthetize, come. So we put it in. Now it should be less than one minute. Then we will pierce the. We will pierce the. So see the time. So record the time. Huh? Don't forget five twenty-four. So by five twenty-five, we should be able to. Of course, observe the hamster. It's five percent isofluorine gas. Is it five percent? Yes. Yes, and then the flow rate. Flow rate about four, three to four. Three. Make it to four. Four, four, and then we observe the hamster. Once he's not moving, once he's not moving, and you just quickly take out. Yeah, they're okay already. Okay, we will do the piercing the, the assistant hope. Uh, pierce the pimple uh, deep in. So that the pass will come out, yeah. Use the cotton cotton bud, cotton bud. Cotton bud should be able to express the pass up. Uh, make sure it all comes out, otherwise you'll recur again. Yeah. Uh, eye drops. You put some eye drops in. Okay, check. Just press, uh, especially from from lower part, yeah, ah, just press it, yeah. Correct, correct. Anyone pass? You see the hamster is so weak. Okay, okay, put, put, okay. Put uh, eye drops in. And then we will 
I think the owner wants the same gland to be treated as well. Okay, give a bit of gas again. Because you don't want to stress him out, but not too long. Wait, wait, is it down already? Okay, then clean the sand gland. Yeah. Use the faucet to clear the, the dirt in the sand gland. Okay, there, there's a dirt. There's a cotton bud, cotton wood, and clean up again. Some, some uh, liquid out uh, there. You can see this hamster is so weak that you, you don't need much gas. Okay, and then after that, make sure it's fully expressed out. Use the faucet to, to express out any more, any more uh, underneath uh, the sand gland. Any more? Press mm -hmm. out. Make sure it's very clean. Okay, then take out the stitches already. These are the 4 0 stitches I did 14 15 days ago. And uh, I'm surprised the hamster didn't bite it off. Huh? Some of them do. What now already? Then the other one. You see, it's so weak that he's, he's still not moving much. Yeah? Younger one would, would be moving around, struggling. With it up. And then clean up. Yeah. Any more? Check, use a swap and clean up. Uh, check the eye for pimple again. Uh, I, 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 it might still have a pimple. Uh. Hmm? There's another pimple on the elbow, is it? I noticed there's some redness on the elbow. Is that, is that pimple? No. Uh? Nothing. Uh? Take away the. There, there's a stitch there. Take away the stitch. Uh. That, don't, just use a faucet to take away the stitch. Any more? Okay, check. Okay then, okay finish lah, that's it lah, that's it, don't take so long, don't take so long, okay, see see the eye, uh, any more, any more, uh, abscess or not? Check, check, check carefully. Uh, you can see the cataract is really bad, no? okay, okay, let it close, close back again, and then put it in here, okay, let it rest, come, put back in the box here. Yeah, see it's so weak that the... Come your hand off, I, I need to see the hamster, yeah, it's very, it's very big. Uh, just let, lie down, uh, no, I mean, on the chest, on the chest, sternal position, facing me probably. Okay, you see how weak it is, uh, not even, not even a few seconds of general anesthetic, but he will recover because we didn't uh, overdose, so we, okay, we finish already, so we, so see the time. 520 how many 28 29 about 4 minutes huh? so we let him recover first yeah? okay we don't disturb him